Oh my god, it's Sonic's birthday! Sonic 1, the best Sonic game, no question. It's 31 years old. I'm 26. Sonic is older, smarter, wiser than I am. I hope that one day I can be Sonic. To celebrate his birthday, I'm gonna make Sonic a kind of birthday card just to say thanks for being such a cool dude all these years. So yeah, pretty much I just wanted to draw something original for once, a standalone piece of art. I'm not maniifying anything, I'm not tracing anything, and to be honest, this is a lot more fun. So I'm pretty much just making this up as I go along and didn't have any plans or anything. And to be honest, I did surprise myself because everything I did looked pretty good first time. Oh, hands. Okay, I really am exposing here how terrible I am at drawing hands. Oh no. Am I even an artist? Why am I here? Ah, oh, another attempt. Eventually though, I did make a hand that actually kind of looks like a hand. Please congratulate me in the comments. So while I'm drawing this little celebration of Sonic's birthday, I want to talk about some, you know, current things like Sonic Origins. You know, that game's nearly perfect. Okay, there's two issues. Uh, there's no Knuckles in the Sonic CD. Why'd they do my boy like that? Honestly though, it makes the game feel really lopsided and just, it just feels bizarre. I will truly only feel like this is the definitive collection if Knuckles gets put in CD, please. Thank you, because you know they're going to do what I say. And then we have the music in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Well. I don't know what to say about it. I'm a massive fan of the prototype music, and I would have been fine with them just using that directly. But uh, what we get is a little bit different, and yeah, I don't know what to say about that. I think I'm a little more salty because I really like the prototype versions. Prototype Carnival Night Act 2 might be my favorite Sonic music. I think he looked a bit plasticky here, but I, I do end up changing how he's shaded. So about this artwork, uh, because I'm not maniifying anything, this is kind of just my own style, I'm just making my own choices here. I'm kind of just drawing Sonic how I want him to look, and that makes it very fun. Although I am definitely inspired by like the, you know, the classic official artwork for the first three games. Although I didn't really use any reference, I think you can kind of tell that I'm, I'm taking some notes from them. Uh, gotta do that anti-aliasing, it's important. An interesting pose I gave him. I just, I just kind of came up with it, and uh, with his left hand, he's meant to be uh, making the three and the one. I thought that was kind of cute.
I did watch the Sonic Origin cutscenes before playing the game, and maybe I shouldn't have because they are amazing. They are so amazing. You know, I almost found myself tearing up watching it because the kind of gaps in the story elements that you kind of imagined when you were playing these games as a kid. I don't know, it's, it's hard to put into words, but it was kind of magical. I've used my Spring Yard background for this image because it's a really cool setting and obviously I've already drawn Spring Yard, I'm not going to draw it again, but uh, I do draw some brand new Spring Yard elements up close because, you know, Sonic's very close up. Literally just editing the game sprites here, you know, I can't avoid doing it, you know, as much as I want to be original. I think Spring Yard is my favourite zone theme of the entire classic series. It's just so freaking wild. It's, you know, it is a city, and normally I, I wouldn't lean towards the city theme stages of any Sonic game, but it's very unique. What kind of city is this? It's a city that fits in a Sonic game so well. We are very, very close to being done now. Finally making some original artwork was so fun. Please let me know if you think I should do more original artwork like this. Alright, it's done. Thank you for watching. So many planned videos that I'm super excited about on their way to you at some point. And, you know, I'm sorry for not releasing videos as often as I'd like to. I've been a busy boy. But you can make me less busy by donating. Who knows, maybe you can double my output. Alright, now I just need to find Sonic's address.